So it's Scottish Breastfeeding Week this week, so we are marking the end of that week with a Lanarkshire Breastfeeding Conference. So we're bringing together um, half parents and uh, mums and babies and half staff from across both NHS and our, our partnership organisations. The theme of Scottish, Scottish Breastfeeding Week is around understanding normal baby behaviour. So our guest speaker is talking about baby communication and responding to baby's needs. We have the speakers talking about Solly Hill with a bit of book bug. So a lot of our theme is around just understanding that babies want to be held close, they will feed often, they're up through the night and all of that is normal. But we're hoping to learn a lot from our families and uh, mums within the room about what we can do to do things better. Lifelong effects for babies and for mums. It protects mums' health and it protects babies' health. In particular, it can help to prevent um, obesity and everything that goes with that as a child grows. But apart from that, it's a lovely way to connect with your baby and the connection between mums and babies can last a lifetime. So we're here today to try and work together with our local community to think what we can do to make a community where breastfeeding is possible for anybody who wants to do it. We know that everybody can, not everyone can breastfeed and not everyone wants to breastfeed, but everyone's got a role to play in supporting it. And that's why we're here today. We're here today to think what we can do to do it to support. Hi, I'm, I'm chair of uh, the health board, Lancashire Health Board, and I'm here uh, to meet uh, mums and health professionals at the uh, Breastfeeding Week in Lanarkshire uh, and I'm going to be speaking to them and just emphasising the commitment that the Health Board has uh, to encourage breastfeeding. Breastfeeding it goes way beyond the relationship between uh, mum and the baby. Uh, it's about society, it's about the best start in life and there's a lot that we can do as an employer um, as a provider of services to make it as easy as possible uh, for mums to be able to breastfeed but also to get the messages out about how important it is to give baby that best start in life. We know that there are going to be uh, uh, mums who won't be able to breastfeed for various reasons or who won't want to but what we can't have is mums being, being uh, uh, discouraged from breastfeeding because of societal norms or other changes that we can do something about. So we need to do something about it because there's no doubt that it's the healthiest start for baby and also there's a big issue in terms of health inequalities across the country and if there's one thing uh, that equalises mums it's their ability to breastfeed. I'm here today at Motherwell Football Club and we are celebrating today breastfeeding week. I'm here with mums and healthcare staff who are supporting mums in their journey to breastfeed and I couldn't be more delighted because it's such an important piece. Breastfeeding is so good for babies and their development but it's also good for the mums and the experience that they have during that time. It's also really, really important for our population because it develops stronger, healthier adults as well. And so it's really exciting to be here as we talk about the subject more openly. Thank you.